Blair Tugman. It's uh, April 19th, just a few short days away from my Bellator 153 fight uh, on Friday, April 22nd at Mohegan Sun Arena uh, against Jay Perrin. I'll be fighting out of North Haven, Connecticut under Andrew Calandrelli and uh, Ultimate MMA Gym. Since my last Bellator fight with Ken Moy, a fight in which I was dominating uh, the first two and a half rounds until I got submitted by Ken there in the last two minutes of the fight, Props to Ken. Uh, I've been training nonstop. I've had two fights scheduled, uh, one being a title fight, and uh, both opponents backed out uh, due to injury the week of the fight. Uh, one of those opponents being Jay Perrin. So uh, it's been difficult mentally, you know, getting geared up for uh, two battles there, and at the last second, someone saying uh, there's no fight. But, uh, you know, as a fighter, uh, I'm always in the gym training. And I think the past eight months has been the biggest jumps in my game that I've ever made. Overall, I give myself the advantage in all skill sets. Uh, my wrestling being my number one uh, skill set most dominant over Jay. Uh, as far as striking goes side by side, I think Jay has, has a little bit more experience as far as uh, boxing goes than I do. But I've been working my tail off the last eight months, improving my striking in all areas. Uh, switching stances, kicks, knees, elbows, uh, really mixing in my strikes with my takedowns. I am a much better and more well-rounded fighter than I have ever been. I'm non-stop. I, I have no doubt in my conditioning, strength. Uh, no one outworks me, and I, and I can guarantee Jay Perrin isn't outworking me. You know, me and Jay don't exactly like each other. He has said some things on social media that kind of ticked me off rub me the wrong way and like I said I'm self-motivated as it is but when someone starts chirping uh, that, that, that brings it to a whole other level so I'm super excited to get out there scrap with Jay hurt Jay and get the finish so that's what Bellator fans and my friends and family are going to see they're going to see a vicious player Tugman go out there and take it to Jay Perrin looking to take his head off so I'm sitting there laying in my bed and uh, I'm, I'm running through my fight in my head uh, and in all different scenarios. You know, I go out and I knock them out right away. I go out, I'm in a battle and I battle back. I mean, I've been through it a million times in my head already. Every single time I've had my hand raised at the end. So you have to have belief in it and yourself and, and, and you have to see it before it happens. And I have seen it for the last two to three months getting my hand raised, so I, I don't see anything different coming uh, Friday, April 22nd. You guys do an amazing job as far as covering the sport of MMA, and I really appreciate what you do for, for the fighters, the fans, uh, and everybody in this great sport. So thank you very much, Sean, uh, for this opportunity to uh, be interviewed by you. Uh, then first and foremost, I really have to thank my family, my mom, my dad, mom, Debbie, Jack, dad, Jack, uh, my two brothers, Blake and Brad, uh, without their support, I wouldn't be here today. So uh, I, I, can't, I can't tell them enough how much I love them and, and, and thank them for everything they've ever done for me. So uh, that's a big, big thing for me, it's family. Uh, next, my coach, Coach Calandrelli, Andrew Calandrelli out of Ultimate MMA, uh, North Haven, Connecticut. Without this guy in my corner, I wouldn't be where I'm at today. Uh, he's given me the skills, uh, necessary to compete at the highest levels uh, and I can't thank him enough and he's a great friend more than uh, more than just a coach he's, a, he's, a, he's one of my best friends so uh, I can't say enough about Andrew and the atmosphere at the gym that he's created over there and uh, all my teammates over at Ultimate MMA uh, thank you guys for everything you've ever done for me all the support anyone who's ever trained with me anyone who's ever supported me come out to one of my fights I can't thank you guys enough for, for what you've done for me. You guys motivate me every day to be a better person, to be a better athlete, to be a better individual. So I can't thank you guys enough. And then lastly, I wanna thank all my Team Tugman wrestlers for motivating me every day. You guys motivate me to hopefully as much as I motivate you to achieve your goals. Uh, thank you to your parents. Thank you to you that come out and support me uh, at these fights. I really appreciate everything you guys do for me. And